Hi everyone. Okay, give me one second. Hola Boconita, ¿qué tal? Pues muy bien. ¿Tú qué tal? ¿Cómo estás? Si desaparezco se pone el Sevilla líder. <risa> bueno, durará poco. Durará poco. Esperemos, claro. <coughs> Ok, so, vamos a, pre a jugar un poco el mazo de Solar Magnezon. Hey Jeremy, thank you Jeremy. He estado por Frankfurt eh, la semana pasada. Este fin de estado en este fin de estado en Granada jugando. He estado en Granada. What's up? Shifu Sansu. Eh, sí, en Granada, muy bien. Hey, Rosark, how is it going? Nice weekend, yes, nice weekend for sure. Nice weekend for sure. Eh, se me dio bien, gané el sábado y el domingo llegué a la final con mi hermano. Así que bastante guay. Really nice weekend, for sure. <coughs> so, let's play the deck. I played on my second league cup. Uh, on Twitter you can find the on my Twitter you can find the list of my two caps. I was um, I was first place on Saturday and second place cup in finals against my brother on Sunday, so that is the deck that I played on Sunday, really funny, really funny for sure, so let's test a little the deck, <clears throat> going to play your bass rock at my next cap, perfect, yes, for me it's the best deck in format, <laughs> So I think the deck is really good, honestly. The deck is crazy good. So, uh, Pokemon, I guess is fine. Energies, and then I play Ultra Ball. So, you can find everything in my Twitter. If you want to see the lists and stuff like that. Almost no one plays as well as you do. Thank you, Jeremy. <laughs> I was super busy. Uh, in Frankfurt Regionals, Razark, there was zero cards 
from Dragon Majesty in day 2 <laughs> but you should get the Reshiram GX maybe Victini Prism the Xenia trainer card um, not so much I guess Reshiram Victini and some trainers maybe yeah you need to test a lot the deck is really complicated <clears throat> the deck is really complicated to play super well even I was playing the deck one month and I was doing a lot of misplays to play perfectly I mean so yeah but the deck has uh, a lot of potential for sure so let's continue putting cards and tomorrow we will play the Malamar Chaimeko that won originals so congrats to Alta Vila to my friend Danny for winning the congrats for winning the regionals of Memphis uh, with the chime meko chimey with the chime boost rock with some more gx focus scores i don't like it i mean i think it's good but i prefer the baby version but the bus rock with heavy big pass you can put more pressure early game so maybe you directly activate this ring uh, slash hammer with losing only one Pokemon GX, not two babies. So you put more pressure, but I guess you have a worse matchups against Rai and Malamar. So I prefer the baby bus, but the uh, big bus should be fine too. So uh, I guess both versions are fine, but I prefer a little more the baby bus. And tomorrow, yeah, we will test the Malamar Chaimeko Chaimi. Yeah, 3 baby bus, 2 bus GX is good too. I played that on my special event on Valencia. I too bad because I draw so poorly and then I did so much so misplays, but at Valencia special event in July I played 3 baby and 2 bus GX. And it was fine. It was fine. I played poorly and then bad draws, so it's fine. Uh, Goose, ma. I played to one choice one for the Dialga GX. Hey man, Makai, how's going? I'm back. I hope to stream four days this weekend. This week, I hope to stream Monday to Thursday because Friday I will travel to a League Cup. So I hope to stream four days in a row if, possi if possible. Hmm. Uh, What more cards? Timer ball. Uh, uh, stadium. I played three, but I was. I really would like to play four stadiums. Honestly, it was super important the stadium, and having only three was weird. So scary sometimes because I didn't hit the energies that I need. So yeah, if I play the deck again, I will play four stadiums. The key is no, yes, Jeremy, I, I think so. Yes, the key is knowing the exactly moment when you bench the big pass plus B-string time to KO something big. That's the key, honestly. So, 554, what I miss, what I miss, what I miss. Maybe a trivial. And four cards. I don't remember. Let's see what more I played. Uh, don't remember. I will check the list. One second. Uh, hey Blue Cast, uh, yes, I will try to get the Soul Galeos. And if I get the Soul Galeos, I will try Solar Soul Galeos. It seems really powerful, honestly. Hola Tour, ¿qué tal? ¿Todo bien? Yeah, it's really funny, Jeremy, definitely. So, what four cards I'm missing? Oh, the Rare Candies, for sure. <laughs> it's really. It, you can't play that deck with Rare Candy, so. <laughs> So, four candies. 
That's the least. Yeah. Yeah, Candice, thank you, Tit. Uh, Suna Moon 7, Thoroark Magneson. Thoroark Magneson, let's go! Let's go! Mm -hmm. uh, I really like uh, to play second max potion too, but one is fine with Mallow. I will put the star. I will quit that star. Okay. So let's see that deck. <laughs> Too obvious. Yeah, I want to try the Solgaleo Soroark with the both Solgaleos. That seems really interesting, right? The new Solgaleo is powerful. <laughs> Rare candies because you don't remember that. <laughs> okay, so we go first. Hey, Poseidon, how is going? No, I start my only Lele. No, I start my only Lele. Why? That is not funny. No. Uh. We need to top deck something. We need to top deck something. I guess we will. Oh, we. Oh, we could. Hmm. Uh, yeah, we can Dialga, right? Let's go. Let's go. Turn two to draw. Turn two to draw cards. We need cards. So, I guess we retreat. It's like if we go second, more or less. Nah, no scoop time, we have the Alga. We have the Alga, so it's fine. No, and he friend ball because we have a Lele on board. So sad. Uh, uh, how do you feel about Sudo in this deck? Nah, no need, no need to do, I guess. You really need the... In, in what deck? Uh, in my deck? I don't think so, because you need space for two, three swords, one Magneson or even two, and then Dax main. So in my deck, you can't bench more things. That's why I don't play Macargo either. No Macargo because no bench space. So it's like you really need the... Uh, it's like you really need a full bench, like three swords, Magneson and the attacker. So no space, I guess. So please don't quit my stadium, please don't quit my stadium. Yeah, no Macargo, no party. I with, I mean, I lost one game in Swiss rounds. I lost uh, one game with in in the six rounds because uh, should I I lost one games in Swiss rounds because I did three trades three trades and with the the energy or mo or the stadium because no macargo no party so my round of Sunday was round one I face uh, let me remember I face Soark, like a rock, I guess. He the draw game one. Uh, game two. I don't remember well, but uh, I could win 2 1, I guess. Because the third game I set up like three Soarks and what Magnus on turn two was crazy. Uh, round two, I face Metagross. I won the coin flip. I have a really good setup turn one, uh, turn two. So he couldn't set up more than. One Metagross, game two, he destroyed me, like two Metagross, turn two, Algorithm GX, GG, um, game three, he did draw. So I was 2-0, then in game three, sorry, round three, I faced a Malamar. Okay, so let's put the... 
double solo, I guess. That matchup is scary, it's not easy. It's not easy, honestly. So, that matchup is not easy. Okay, so we have the Magnus on turn 2 if he can't Guzma the Magnemite. Yeah, the Lika on Spain are best of 3. That is really nice, I guess. I don't like best of 1, so that is really nice. Best of 3. Uh, the Lika in Spain are best of 3. So, game, uh, round 3 I face Malamar. Uh, he beats me 2-0. That's the same guy that I later will beat in top 4. Uh, he had uh, insane uh, draws, <laughs> really insane draws. Okay, so he's gonna Guzma by, Mag by Magnemite, I guess. He has one Guzma in the discard, so that's gonna be the second Guzma. So we will bench another Magnemite and attack with the Alga, I guess. So he has insane draws, he beats me <clears throat> uh, easy. And game 2, I had the win, but I with energy or stadium with 3 trades, so he beats me 2 0. So, yeah, let's. He can. No, he has no energy, so it's fine. So, should I put Magnemite and pass? Uh, we have we have a stretcher, so. We really don't need the Zoroark right now. We need the Magnemite for sure. Okay, and we have a Cynthia. So he has two Guzma in the discard. I hope he has no more the third Guzma right now. Hola Pedro, what are your opinions on Zoroark Control? Burrito, I really like Zoroark Control. Nah, that is a joke. That is a joke. <laughs> Come on. That is a bad joke. Uh, Sorrow Control is really nice, I guess, but you lose to... I mean, Malamar is not easy. Magneson is auto loss. Rayquaza is super hard. Uh, there is a lot of decks that I guess they are not a good matchup, honestly. So if you don't face decks that want to hit KOU or Malamar, it's fine. Hola PokeGX, juego con suscriptores, lo recuerdo, vale. Leave him alone. Uh, should I put the DC here, for example? Okay, so we have the Stretcher and the third Magnemite. Never lucky. I can't. Oh. With <laughs> nah, he goes math three times. Not fair. So I was two one. Then I faced Sor like and rock again. Uh, my opponent did draw game one, game two. He had the win, but he misplayed, so I beat him. If not, try, uh, if not, uh, oh, eighty. If not, I guess I could. Um, so let's scoop. No Magnemite, no party, no Zoroark, nothing, no Ultra Ball, nothing. So uh, if, even if I tie, if I tied round four, I had the possibility to win the last. I entered in the cup with 3 1 1. But uh, I won game round four, so I was 3 1. So I ID uh, round five to enter with 3 1 1. And in top eight, I face Zoro Pot. That should be a, f a good matchup. Um, if I set up, should be a good matchup for sure. So, uh, game one, I won the coin flip. So, turn two, I had Madness on, so I win. Game two, uh, he KO my two Soruas early game, so she wins. And in Gen exit. Game three, I set up perfectly, so I won, because that's main. It's for 220, the Golisopot and Sorax. So. It was a good matchup if I set up. Yeah, going first is a super advantage this format. Going first is a really, really super advantage in this format. Okay, perfect. We have four towers for Nestball, so normally you have a Magnemite or one, normally. Uh, that's my 
the cross my heat run and minus one would be good. Maybe. Uh, I didn't have. No. Candy Venusaur? No, no way. No way, Candy Venusaur, please. No, 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 an energy? No, an energy? No way. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, should be good. That's my encroachment. Hitran, I don't guess. Hit in this deck that you have sword, Hitran is not necessary, I guess. But that's main, yes. So, uh, let's. I really want to put two energies into the discard so I can. Um, okay, let's attach the treat. Candy. Magneson. Ability. Uh, ability here, I guess, Cynthia. So we need two energies, right? Mm -hmm. We need two energies or stadium. So I guess we go for uh, another Surua. I will trade one timer ball. We, uh, we keep the other in hand. Perfect. So. Let's kill the Genesis. I guess he can cure my gen my. He needs a lot of energies, right? So 220 turn two. Imagine that is imagine that is gonna be. Imagine we face a GX deck. So 220 turn two is really good, right? 20 turn two is really good, right? So now he can hit for. Uh, 70, 90, 110, 130. 130 with choice band 160. It's not a KO. Yeah, he needs a lot of things with normal Excel here. So 220 turn 2 is really fine. So in top 8, I beat the Sauropod. And then in top 4, I face the same Balamar player. And he runs 3 games, Lily turn 1, and 3 in case. That was crazy, honestly. Okay, that's the stadium, perfect. So we can Malo for Max Potion Energy. No, we need more things, we need more things. So I will Timer Roll first. Perfect, let's put a sword. So I guess we can Lily too. Lily is fine too. Lily is fine too, right? If he KO the Necrozma is fine anyway. So, uh, I guess we don't need the Lele. So he has uh, three games. He has uh, three games really crazy. Okay, so let's put another for later. Mm -mm. So Stadium Ability. So uh, he has the three games, Lily turn one with three in case. So that was super scary, honestly. But game one, uh, he misplayed one turn, one crucial turn with the stadium, so he couldn't retreat with the psychic energy. So he has no enough psychic energy in the discard, and I had the perfect setup. So I control my Guzmas in mid game to hit the two Guzmas into two GXs to win. Game two, I the draw like Sorua. Four energies, two stadiums, and I lost. Everyone was loving like, low, 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 what a hand. Uh, impressed with the Malamar list? Yes, Chaimeko is really good. So I'm really impressed. Malamar seems super good if you set up like Lily for one and three in case. So he's gonna be a tier one for sure. Uh, why trade the Ultra Ball over Lily? When I have two Sorks, I guess it's more or less the same, right? Uh, so, should be fine because you have two trades, so I guess it's the same, right? Lily could be good into the opponent, maybe judge me or something. I guess we don't need Cynthia. I guess we can throw the Ultra Ball. 
sorry, the um, that is 160. We can through the the candy. So we can mallow for max potion and energy. Yeah. So we can mount a stadium and okay, so let's mallow for max potion energy. That seems good. I guess we don't need the stretcher. So yeah, and game two the draw and game three was uh, game three was super close. Game three was really really close, and uh, I won by one turn. But he could win perfectly. But I won by one turn because I hit the Guzma at the correct time with traits. But it was super close, honestly. Even if I played Soark and he plays Malamar, it was super super hard. I guess Lillian four in case, uh, three in case the three games, and the finals uh, I had the 100 points. So at that point I scoop with my brother so he can earn some points. So he's at 102 points. What do you think about Pass Rock American list? Uh, I think it's really fine, but I prefer the Baby Pass version, I guess. But the Big Pass version against some decks is better. And against other decks is worst because you can't sledgehammer some turns because he KO something in the bench and deck big pass. So it depends on what you face. But big pass should be better against some decks that you put more pressure, right? But it should be worst against Malamar in the theory. Okay, so uh, uh, let's trade the Lily. We can Guzma this Lukma, for example, right? Let's trade the Zork and no more trade, I guess. Stadium. Let's go for the Sluggy. No more cargo, no party. So yeah, that's my opinion of Bastrock. But American proves that Bastrock is one of the best deck in format because in what 800 players at Memphis, four Basro did top eight. But Chainmaker is really interesting, honestly. I mean, depends on the matchup. Uh, Big Pass, EV line is better or not. I prefer Baby Bass. I feel that you have more control with Baby Bass line because you control the Sledgehammer turn. And I guess you have more option than it's Malamar too. But the deck is really hard to play anyway, so really hard to play perfectly. So even I was playing the deck one month and I do some misplays with the Macargon Giant. So you know we need to test a lot the deck to play perfectly. And sometimes you have a dead hand too, like every deck. But it's my favorite deck right now, with no doubt. So let's kill the Lurantis, right? Let's kill the Lurantis to 10. That's main too strong. Uh, yes, Cogodin. Because maybe you have a best, better matchup against Soark with a baby big pass. But. In general, you win against Zorak anyway, right? So... Mm. Okay, that was a good win. 220 turn 2. Broken. Well played. <clears throat> and we have the choice one for Metagross. We need to 250. Or against or with dumbbells. Oh no, yeah, that's the same. So the deck is really funny. I mean, not sure if I will play the deck in a big tournament like regional because it's a stage 2 deck. But for a league cup, it's really good. Mm -mm. 
Malamar is super good, honestly, right now, because no, because normally, uh, old format, I mean, before the new format, you beat a lot of times Malamar because you KO the Malamar plus N or something like that, and in the end they they have a really hard time. So now with no N, they have like Ultra Wars and Treasure to set up really consistently. They have Lilies, Leles, Cynthia's, so it's really easy that for Malamar to set up. And now with no N, once the opponent set up three Malamars, for example, at board, with three Malamars they can auto-win like every deck normally. So Malamars is one of the best contender for sure right now. Because no one in the format and as long as they set up three Malamars is broken deck. But the baby bass rock matchup against Malamar is really good. I mean it's no, it's really good, it's really close. I beat more Malamas than they beat me. Because normally at one point they need to bench a Lele like this, or they need to bench a Dan Wings or Necrozma, so that's the two prices that you can take it to then win the price race. Thanks to Baby Bass, Sledgehammer, Like a Rock, this ring. So I guess it's a really interesting matchup for both sides. But yeah, Malamar is one of the best decks for sure, and Baby Bass Rock in my opinion too. Uh, maybe if Malamars continue playing a lot, we will come back in Baby Bass or Sword decks. Maybe we will can uh, come back. Yeah, Marca Macargon Jay is super good. So, for example, my opponent did Lily 3 in case and Marsha Dominator 1. That is really, really powerful. That's the one of the reason the Marshadow things. That's one of the reason the Marshadow things that I changed. The original list has four Cynthia to Lilies, but all people playing right now the Marshadow and Judge. I opt. I prefer four Lilies to Cynthia's for situations like that. So I'm really happy to. I'm really happy to have the four lilies over four Cynthia's, honestly. I guess he's gonna KO my Sorua, so let's go for triple Sorua. But then we can double Sorua and Cynthia. I lost two to Ultra World, that is not really good because Ultra World is another out to Magneson, but I really want to play to Sora next turn, and he won the coin flip, so he's gonna kill my Sorua. Like uh, a lot of chance that he kill my Sorua. So I don't like to lose two Ultra Balls, but I really want to secure the sec the two Sora action field, honestly. <sighs> That's one psychic recharge. So he marched though, turn one. So let's see if he has supporter or not. I don't think so. So he has no supporter, that is really good. So we can uh, we can trade to try to find the candy, but in this deck that we only play three Guzmas, it's really, I mean, I, re I miss a lot the four Guzma in these decks playing in the League Cup, so I really want to save the Guzmas, the three Guzmas like uh, gold. That's why I don't trade the Goose. So let's trade one metal. Let's trade uh, Lele, I guess. We can trade the Cynthia too, right? So let's evolve. I don't want to kill the Marshadow. I prefer to kill a. Uh, I prefer to kill a. Um, a Malamar. I guess we don't need the thirst. Another Sorua. He has nothing, so let's set up the Dialga, I guess. Let's 
and pass. <laughs> yes, go good. Yo, polymerization. How is going? Hey, Sombra Curse. How is going? I hope everything was is fine. New week, testing new decks. Didn't go so well. They can make the new Solgaleo with Sorg. So is Solgaleo better? Okay, I see. So yeah, maybe straight Solgaleo better. Nice. That is nice. I guess we can trade one sort of one. So yeah, I, I want to try Sora Solgaleo and Straight Solgaleo. It's gonna it's going so much traveling. Yes, Pokemon Life, right? <laughs> Pokemon Life. We have the max potion. So much traveling. Pokemon Life. I guess we can trade one Magneson. I really want to hit the goose. The goose. I mean, next turn. I will evolve because now he can goose my the Magnemite. How many energies he has in the discard? Three. Where is the goose? There is no goose. Uh, 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 let's power up the Dialga. Right. And let's pass, I guess. I will Nest Ball for last main. Nah, another Magnemite. For later. Let's pass. I don't want to, to Kakeo. <clears throat> I want to wait for a KO into Malamar if possible. So the opponent March Shadow into himself to the draw. Yes, Chaimeko. <laughs> I mean, against the deck that I'm playing now, the Chaimeko is really good, right? Chaimeko hit and then I have nothing, but. Oh, we have the Alga to kill Chaimeko and do 80. <laughs> That's the only way. The Alga, 3 attachment. Uh, attack with the Alga. Okay, so let's try to find the... Let's try to find the... One of the three Guzmas. Please. Never lucky. Oops, I, I, don't, I don't want to do that. Uh, it's fine. Uh, it's fine. I want to do trade. Please, one of the three Guzmas. Let's go. Uh, should I max potion? I think so. I will Lily for one. Pass. I don't want to take a KO. I want to wait to the Guzman Malamar. Yeah, there, is, there are ways to around Chimeco for sure. <laughs> there are ways to round around Chimeco for sure. Uh, like 13 cards and no Guzman yet. Come on. Come on. <laughs> you only need one Guzma to kill Malamar. Only one. No. <laughs> Holy poggers. Come on. I, maybe I have two Guzma price. Oh, finally. I don't want to trade the game because maybe I lose. So. I guess KO this thing is fine. Let's. Okay. So next round we try to get another Malamar if possible. Is draw passing? I should put more pressure. Why? Oh, he top deck Cynthia. No third trade. I have eight cards in the deck, so no need, no need it right now. 
Yeah, I could attack the Mewtwo, right? I could get it. I could attack the Mewtwo Cocotin, right? It's fine. It's fine. We top the Xintia. So we have two Guzmas left. That's the Mewtwo. So I will try to find a second Guzma. So I will trade once. I can't trade again, right? I can't lose for deck out. So, one that is not KO. Yeah, I should attack the Mewtwo before. Mewtwo is good in Malamar, I guess. Mewtwo is good in Malamar. Yeah, I should, I should attack the Mewtwo before. Mm. I should drag into Mewtwo before, so... One hundred. Magnus is not too strong. Yeah, I should attack the Mewtwo before, honestly. That's the Marshadow. Mm. So he can copy later. Uh, uh, so I guess it's time to attack with the um, Dux main. I guess it's time to attack with the Dux, Dux main. Necrozma. So we really need a Guzma right now. We really need a Guzma. Perfect. So. I will time over to see what I have in the deck. Okay, the third Guzma is in the deck, perfect. So I guess I will Guzma the I guess I will Guzma the Lele, so then we can Dialga GX KO the Marchado. So Stadium. Uh, energy Tribal. So I guess we kill the Lele and then GX the Marchado. I think so. And Guzma to win the game, so let's see. Agneson. So he needs to kill the Dialga, right? He needs to kill the Dialga. So I guess we don't trade, right? No need it. No need trade. So next turn we can GX with the Alga de Marchado and Guzma to win the game. I think so. Okay, perfect. That's retrieval is perfect, honestly. Yep, timeless would be good, but he had the Downwings attack. He had the Downwings attack, so I couldn't uh, attack the Marchado. Uh, the stretcher is in the discard. That is the problem. He needs to Guzma the Dialga, I guess. The stretcher is in the discard. I couldn't GX the Marchado because he had he has protect from the GX of Danwings, so I couldn't touch it. That's the reason Black Panther victim. So stretcher is in the discard. That's the another Marchado. I hope he doesn't Guzma the Dialga, please. If he Guzma the Dialga, I guess we lose, right? No. No, he knows the way. He knows the way. He knows the way. He knows the way. So if Quickie or the Malamar we win the game. We have one Guzma left. Mm. So next time he can march out though. Energy. Ah, oh, but if we Guzma the Malamar, we have no more Guzma left.
Oh, Sombra Curse just subscribe. Thanks a lot, Sombra. Thanks a lot. I, it didn't appear in the uh, in the stream or OB, OBS. I don't know why it didn't appear in the stream. But thanks a lot for the subscribe. I don't know what reason that uh, don't appear the soup in the layouts. I'm not sure. But thanks a lot, Sombra. Really thanks. So if we Guzma the if we Guzma the Malamar, we have no Guzma left. We have no Guzma left to win the game because he's gonna attack with a one press attacker. So yeah, we lose because uh, we lose because we don't attack the Mewtwo in early game. That's the reason, honestly. That's why that's why we lost. Because we didn't attack the... We didn't attack the... Um, Mewtwo in early game. The choice band is in the... I mean, if we have the choice band, we can kill the Marchado with the Magneson. But the choice band is in the prize. Choice band is in the prize. That's sad. That's sad. Choice bus, choice bank is in the price. Uh, so if he has the, another Guzma, GG. He has two Guzmas, right? Yeah. So I guess we lose. Nah, that's sad. That's sad. We simply should attack the Mewtwo early game. Or if we have four Guzmas, we can Guzma the Malamar and wins, I guess. Uh, yeah, Cocotin was right. We should attack. We should attack in the early game the Mewtwo, so we will win the game. So I don't know why it didn't appear the subscribe of Sombra. I need to check. After the string, I will check. After the string, I will check why it didn't appear. Mm, I don't want to use the GX because mm, he I have three energies and maybe he can power up a Lele with it, double Malamar, energy choice, but I didn't do the maths. But three energies, he imagine he has three, six. Okay. So, GG. I tried. He has the energy per. In hand. Oh, he has eight energies in the discard. So maybe he has no energy. Maybe he has no energies in the in, the, in hand. But yeah, we can use the GX too. But I didn't do the math, and so maybe Lele could kill the Necrozma, but not. Oh, lol, he has no energy. He can copy. <laughs> So we win, right? We win, right? Can't KO. It's not a KO, right? Oh, it's, it's 190? Oh, yes. Okay, yeah, it's 190. Yeah, the choice one was prize. If the choice one... He's the energy. If the choice one wasn't prize, we could KO with Magneson. So he takes one prize. But the choice one was into the prizes. Oh, he could copy the Mimikyu too, Jeremy. That's true. So we should do the GX, definitely. So we should do the GX because he could copy the Mimikyu and win. So definitely the GX was the better play. The GX was the better play, for sure. We should do the GX. So uh, one less option for the opponent. To KO my neck by Dax main. Okay, Soro Arc. Lily for four. Should be fine. Should be fine. I will retreat. I will do the stadium. Normally he can't kill Soro at one, normally. And I will pass. So we have the Candy Magnuson turn 2, that is really fine. That's really nice.
Okay, double slug ma, double sorua and slug ma. I will try one thing. Great ball. He had the judge, but he didn't do the judge. And he had a lot of cards in hand, but he didn't judge. That is nice for us. Oh, and the Cynthia, so. I guess I will do the Cynthia, I guess. I will use the DC. Really good top deck. Really, really good top deck. Okay, so. Uh, straight. We need one basic. We need one basic, perfect. Mm. I guess I will stadium an ultra ball for another Sorua, I guess. Put more swords in field. We don't need to use Magneson if we don't need uh, something important at one point of the game because we can use Magneson uh, later with no problem. So I will take what I will test one thing in the stream labs. So it seems there is I don't know why I can't it doesn't appear the follows and subs. Maybe an, maybe it's an update of uh, Streamlabs. Uh, I guess it's 50-50 polymerization. If you play well, B stream, baby bass, and like rock, it's not easy. But I guess it's 50-50. That's my opinion. So that's a sort of McCargo, right? So we have Magneson, so it should be fine, I guess. So maybe there is a new update. That's why it didn't appear the followers and the subs. So I will try to fix it. Uh, to fix it. So he hit. So should we go for the lily? I guess. Should we go for the Lily, I guess? I mean, how many candies? We have one candy left. So he can't get the Magneson easy, right? So... Can't get the Magneson easy, so... I guess we go for that play. Um, Lily and then trade. Should be fine. The matchup is pretty close. Yes, it's pretty close. First rate, second rate, mm -hmm. second rate. Stadium. We whiff for one energy, right? We just rival. <clears throat> so I guess we can leave that Zorak as a prize. Right? I guess we pass. We can give that Zorak as a prize, right? I think so. Yeah, you go baby bass, so then power of like and rock and beast ring. It's hard, but it's fine, I guess. So the idea now is KO two swords in one turn. That's the idea. KO two swords in one turn. So we can use the GX. 
or we can use the 222. So I'm not sure why it doesn't appear the follows and subs. I need to check it. Something is wrong. Why this doesn't appear? Okay, so he quit the stadium. So I, I guess I will try to check it later. But for some reason, don't appear the follows and subs. So if there is new followers, thanks for the new followers, but I need to see what is wrong, so for some reason don't appear for a new update, I guess. I will check it later. What's the play? We need a broken deck? Yes, we need a broken deck. Ludicargo, lul. It's Ludicargo. It's Ludicargo. So. I guess we save the GX for Dialga. I guess we save the GX for Dialga. So I guess we trade one metal. Okay, make a Weavile broken so you cover <laughs> every matchup. You cover every matchup. So I guess we will save the GX for Dialga, right? That should be. Cool. So choose two metals in the discard. Let's put another magnesium. Let's put the stadium. Let's use the stadium. So should we bench the Dialga? I will with the Nesbol, I guess. Okay, so we have the Lele and two Guzmas in the deck. Perfect. Lele and Tugusmas in the deck, so I will power up uh, this boy. So if he if he KO this boy, we have uh, the GX of the Alga, I guess. So because he can KO with the he can KO with the shrine choice band Kukui or something like that. So to twenty. I mean, we can lose. We have two trades to find one Guzma and one energy. We have two trades to find one Guzma and one energy. Okay, we have the Guz. We need one energy. I put the energies because I fear the possible... I fear the possible judge. So... Normally, so Cargo plays... Normally, so Cargo plays the... Normally Soro Cargo plays uh, two Crashing Hammers only. So I guess next turn we can Guzma the Mac Cargo. He needs choice Kukui, so I guess next turn we can Guzma the Mac Cargo. Because we need three energies and this, yeah. So he has the Goose to what? Maybe Guzma for next turn. Is there any deck that doesn't care about going second? Uh, Baby Bass. <laughs> Baby Bass is fine going second, I guess. Should be fine, Baby Bass going second. Thanks a lot to the 50 viewers. We are more than 50 viewers. Thanks a lot. Gracias a todos. Somos más de 50 ahora mismo. I hope you are enjoying the stream. I hope you are enjoying that. The state to deck is really funny. And if there is new followers and new subs, uh, sorry if I don't say nothing because it doesn't appear in the overlay. I don't know the reason, but it doesn't appear in the overlay. The new followers and 
uh, subs. I will try to watch after the stream what is the reason, but thanks to the all the new followers and subs for sure. So I guess we should we need to Guzma de Macargo, but we need two energies. We need two energies, right? So mm, that is a problem. I guess we can throw the stretcher. Now nah, let's throw the lily. We have to trace. We need to find two energies. Or the stadium. We can mallow. We can't mallow, right? We can't mallow. Mallow is not a KO, so. Give me one stadium, please. One stadium. Oh, perfect. That is perfect. Holy poggers. So now we can do the goose, right? Now we can do the goose. So, what is the best play here? He can do one. He can't 190, right? We can do 150 to this. No, to Mac Cargo and then. 150 to Mac Cargo. I guess we should go Das main. I guess we kill the Mac Cargo, right? And then we go smart to win the game. So. Uh, and he, he can do 180. We can he can't counter catcher. He can do 180 with Guzman. No, it's not possible. So, I guess we Guzman the Macargo. Here with Zorg, I guess. So, and we save the energies. Uh, and I guess we will put the Zorua. No, I will wait to bench this for next turn. So, 100. So, I guess it's really hard for him to KO something. I th he can't contain Karcha because we are 2-2 two, two at price. So, he can't do 180 with Guzma. I guess. So, we are we should be fine. Now, the opponent is going to judge us. So, in the judge, we need to find the uh, three energies into the Alga, for example. So, he's going to judge for sure, I guess. Hey Burrito, I do coaching in the past, but now I'm so busy with some things, with uh, more things than before, so I have a little time free right now, only free time to co uh, to stream, so I hope to come, in, come back uh, into coaching things later in the future, but I'm not sure when it's gonna be exactly, so right now not, but I hope to coach in the future. GX of the Alga, but if I GX of the Alga, he puts one price attacker active. I couldn't kill the Lele, it was, I hit 150, he has 160. So if I GX with the Alga something, he puts one price attacker in the active and maybe I whiff the Guzma again to win. That's why I take the kill into my cargo. En Frankfurt hice top 8, Pogonita. Perdí en top 8, pero bueno, llega el top 8. He can counter catcher uh, the comic. Imagine he counter catcher uh, choice band Kukui Stadium. So 180 into the Dialga. If I Guzma something and KO with Necrosma, he could. With this hand, he could counter catcher choice band Kukui KO Dialga. I mean, it's really hard, right? But maybe it's possible, right? With this play, he can't counter catcher, so I guess it's the safe play. I guess this is the safe play, so he needs to judge. We have the win right now, so he needs to judge. We have no more stadiums. Okay, he goes for the sword. So we have the max potion in the deck, right? Okay, we have the goose. So we need we need one energy. I think so. Right? We have the Mac we have no more stadium, no more retrieval. 
So I will trade one. So, uh, we need one energy to KO the Lele. So we have no more retrieval, no more stadiums, so... If we mallow for double energy, we need to retreat. That is not easy. I need to retreat too, so if we Guzma, we, we don't take a KO, so we'll Nest Ball to see the deck. So we can Mallow for double energy, retreat, and we are one energy far away. We have the Max Potion in the deck? No, we don't have the Max Potion in the deck. We don't have the max potion in the deck. This is in the discard. So I guess we can't mallow because max potion is in the price. Nah, this is not real. <laughs> max potion is in the... Max potion is in the... Max potion is in the price. So we need to trade again. Double energy. No, no, can't believe it. Ah, no way. Oh, we lose that game. We have three energies. Ah, really? One energy, really? One energy away. That is super sad. That is super sad. The max potion is in the prices. That is not... Ah. That is not funny. Because we can max potion, we can do... A lot of things. I mean, max potion gives us the win. Max potion is the last prize. Max Potion give us the win, one energy give us the win, a lot of things give us the win. Uh, never lucky. We have a lot of outs, right? We have a lot of outs. Energy give us the win, Max Potion give us the win. So maybe I should Nest Ball to hit the Lele. So what more outs to hit the energy into the second trade. I couldn't time like yes, I had no one energy away. Uh, away. Uh, well, I missed one energy. Yeah, I should nest ball into the Lele, so one more, one less out. I mean, more chance to hit the. Uh, with nest ball Lele, we have more outs to hit the energy into the trade. That's true. Never lucky. No más cargo, no party. Yes, you are through the comic. No más cargo, no party. Ah, uh, never lucky. <laughs> it was funny, it was funny. It was a really uh, close game. It was a really super close game. So another Malamar. All people is playing Malamar. I hope don't... I don't want to face any Chaimiko, Chaimeko. The chime. That hand is sad. Please judge me. No. That hand is sad. Judge me, please. So, yeah, I want to solve it the thing with the don't appear the followers or the soups. Should be something, uh, should be that we need an update with the OBS or something. So, there are acrobikes in the discard. Another in K. Every Malamar puts two in case or three in case in four. Uh, Frankfurt Hugue, Bass, Bass Rock, Baby Bus, Lick and Rock. Con Macargo, Pogonita. So, double in case. So, should we? I mean, he can KO us, right? 
If he has a supporter, he can cave us. Oh, I will try the Lily to try to find a basic. Ooh, yee. Nice! <laughs> he put a surprise face. Should I put. Should I retreat? Ah, oh, that is so hard. He's gonna KO me. He's gonna KO me, right? Hmm. I will take the risk. Maybe he whiffs. I will take the risk. Maybe he whiffs. So, Cynthia, he has the second supporter for sure. After the Cynthia stretcher. The Oxys, Marcia, okay, both. So he finds Devil Malamar or not? He finds Devil Malamar or not? That's one Malamar. Double Guzma. He should has he should have a really good hand. He threw double Guzma. So he's gonna uh, KO with the uh, Necrozma, right? Uh, re, my opponent gets everything. This is the first one, yeah, for me too. Can we come back? Can we come back? Or not. I guess we should do this play. I guess we should do this play. Now we evolve. And now we mallow, right? We'll play it. No, now we'll play it. You have everything turned two. That is not funny. Should we mallow? For what? For Cynthia, I guess. No, for Lily, Sorua, maybe. Lily, so then we draw the Sorua. And try to come back. Let's try to come back. Yeah, that Mallow is hard, but... We need to set up. He has supporter again. He has supporter again. He has the lily. No. <laughs> no. No. He can't copy nothing with the Marshall though. Because he recovered the Deoxys too. Sounds crazy. Tell tell that the comic. I will repeat to the new people that Sorif doesn't appear the new subs and followers, but for some reason that doesn't appear. Uh, I will try to check after the stream for tomorrow is gonna be fix it, I hope. It's gonna be an update of OBS or something. So he's gonna mimic you. Second Malabar or 13k. No. <laughs> that Game may makes me sad. Garbo boxing is needed, maybe. Okay, that's a good hand. I can't complain. That's a good hand, I can't complain. But we are in a really tough position. We're in a really tough position. Right? Because next turn he's gonna march out okay, I mean. I'll try this. Re Pass. So he can copy the oxys and GG. Friend ball with Garbotoxin is Valence card. <laughs> I mean, Garbotoxin plus N 
was the good combo. Now Garbatosing with no N is not that good because the opponent can blow her. Lily, please, with the KO, please. Only once, with the KO. That's another Malamar. Please. Malamar too strong if they run like this. Malamar too strong to run. They run like this. He has the energy in hand. Or not. Okay. He has no energy in hand. That is good. That is good. That is good. So we have a we have a little option. Let's go. We have a little option. Let's go. One trade. Okay. Okay. So should I second trade one stadium? I guess I don't want to trade the goose or the choice. So stretch her back to Surua. Should I GX mm, stadium? I mean, it's not a KO with Zoroark because we need one more basic. Do we kill the Marcha though? I think so. So then he needs a lot of things. Should I kill the Marcha though? Should I kill the Malamar? The Machado is scary, right? Should I kill one Malamar? He can't copy nothing to kill my Necrozma. Kill with Magneson? No, because then I lose the Magneson. Oh, I can kill the Machado with Magneson. But then he kill with Necrozma, right? Then he kill with Necrozma the Magneson. That is the problem. The problem is that. He kills the Magnuson. I guess we kill the Malamar, honestly. I guess we kill the Malamar. Mm. That is... Malamar's Marchado, Malamar Marchado, Malamar Marchado, Malamar Marchado. Okay, let's get the Marchado. Not sure, honestly, not sure. Not sure. Maybe Kyo Malamar uh, was a better option, maybe. I don't want to use the 220 because he can copy with Mimikyu. If I use the 220 attack, he kill with Mimikyu, that's the reason. So he can't KO with this because we have a psychic resistance. But he can bench another Marchado, discard a Necrozma maybe. Mm, not sure. Not sure. I mean, there is no point to KO with Magneson anyway because he's a 5 price, so he's gonna KO. Uh, 3 GXs anyway, or 2 GX is one, one price attacker, so let's go with 3 GXs and he bench, he down to 3, 1 price and then he needs to KO another GX. So we start so bad that game, but maybe we come back, maybe. We start so bad that game, maybe we come back, honestly. Maybe. Let's see. We can come back after that rogue start. And he set up super good, honestly. He set up. Uh, so, okay, so he can't kill with the Necrozma because. Uh, he can't scale with Necrozma because he's, we have a resistance. Oh, but the attack through the resistance? No, it's the GX. So I guess we KO this, right? 
Or we kill the active. Nah, we kill this. With the Guzma. But if we kill this. Yeah. Let's kill this. So. I will trade. One metal. Let's Guzma the Necrozma GX, I guess. We will have one Guzma to end the game. Let's trade the Ultra Ball. Revenge another Magnemite, maybe. Let's trade the Lele. Nice ball for Whiff. Yep, I think so. Stadium. So. This. So then we attach. We can lose the DC, right? Oh, we can do one. Nah, he's gonna kill with Mimikyu anyway, so. He's gonna kill with Mimikyu anyway, so we are losing the energy anyway. So. So, when he kills with Mimikyu, we kill the Mimikyu, and then we need one Guzma to win the game. Right? So now he needs. Okay, with Mimikyu, we kill the Mimikyu. And then we need to hit the Kuzma to win the game. That should be fine. Muy buenas noches, Edu, ¿qué tal? Pero enhorabuena por el top 4, creo, ¿verdad? Entraste en top 8 los dos. Creo que caíste en top 4, puede ser. En muy, muy enhorabuena y muy buenas noches. So we have two prizes remaining to win. So maybe we have a, maybe we can come back. We need to hit the third Guzma at the end game because he's gonna kill with Mimikyu. And then next turn, I hope that he kill with Danwings Necrozma. Sorry, uh, yeah, Danwings, yeah. So, los cuatro dos perfectos. Y en el buen por fin de muchas gracias también. Muchas gracias. La verdad que fue bastante bien. So I guess we come back. With that rogue star and he having everything. So I guess we can play Bass Rock a little too today. No, it's better to have four Guzmas, honestly. I really miss the four Guzmas, so you should play four Guzmas or three and Palpat for sure, I guess. <clears throat> so let's go with Zoro. So I guess we go Cynthia. I want to whiff this. Nah, not whiff. Let's put this. Uh, let's Ultra Ball the Dialga and the uh, Lily. For a Magneson, we need to thin the deck to have the Guzma to win the game. And let's put the choice fan. Nah. Okay, why not? Let's put the choice fan. And then we need Cynthia. Yep. And three trades. Where is the bootcamp for wars? At uh, my beach house, Coco Team. For sure. My beach house. We just get Spaz Rock for a league cup. I mean, if you expect a lot of Malamar. If you expect a lot of Malamar, maybe play something with Weavile or Garbodor or Sorg, right? So, not sure. If you expect a lot of Malamar, I mean, you can beat Malamar, but maybe you can beat Malamar with another deck in an, in an easy way, right? So, it depends on what meta you expect. You can play Weavile or Sprint Malamar or something like that. So, Stadium. So let's power up some things. We have the Guzman to win the game. So let's power up a lot of things. So let's retrieval two. So we have two Pokemon. 
Ah, what ups? Eh, ah, let's go. So the only way he wins is if he judge us. We have the win. Don't know the meta, so play a deck that you like. Uh, the comic, play a deck that you like. Password is fine, Malamar is fine, Sword is fine. So you can choose. So let's play Bassrock, the deck that I played in the Saturday League Cup. Some games. Yep, Tapu Go Flying Flip things sounds really good too. That is pretty decks are really good, honestly. Sorry's dead. <laughs> so maybe he march shadow us or maybe he judge us. That's why I think the deck a lot. Kuzma. Okay, so GG. GG We have the goose. What is the energy split for that deck? I play one DCE <laughs> Oh for Malamar you mean? Uh, for that deck, I don't know honestly For that deck, I don't know The spread deck. I didn't play the spread deck I guess One day I will play that So we come back after the rock ro start I will show the list again and uh, let's play Bass Rock a little. Let's let's see if we face some Balamars and let's see if we can deal with them. Now that all people is playing the That is the list that I played in the League Cup. Really funny. You can wahike your things, you finish three games, always finish three games, losing or winning. Yeah, uh, League King I'm showing the list. It's really funny, I recommend the four stadium maybe. The alga is not needed, not really needed. A stretcher is cool. Maybe Great Ball or Timer Ball, not sure. I guess we can quit the DC and enter the 10 basic. And uh, maybe for Guzma. What do you think of Tapu Goku Baby Bass? Eh, no la he probado, pero tiene buena pinta, la verdad. Tampoco ahora se. Creo que está un poquito más fuerte ahora que hay tanto Malamar. Tampoco parece bastante fuerte. Y combinarlo con Baby Boost puede ser interesante. A ver si lo pruebo un día. So now let's play the Basswall I can run my cargo that I played on. That I played on. Eh, on the League Cup, I didn't play Oranguru finally, I played three Kukuis. And I played one corner, but maybe we should play 270 HP. That's the play, that's the list that I play into the Saturday League Cup that I won. With three Kukuis to improve the baby bus and Malamar matchup. Thanks to that, you have a, an easy way to KO in case. Thanks to the Ancient Kukui and Keo uh, Baby Bass things in two shots. So the third Kukui helps a lot too in my finals against Ho Salazel and helps a lot too against Rayquaza. So that is the list that I played in the League Cup. So let's test a little. Let's hope to find to face some Malamars. So if we face some Malamars, we can uh, see if we can beat them or if it's close matchup. Let's see. We need another Guzman, yes. We need the four Guzman for sure, I guess. Or Palpa. Because a lot of time we we were praying like, oh we need the we need the four Guzman, we need the four Guzman. So yeah, definitely. And maybe we, we could the Dialga. Never use it. Only sometimes. Okay, so a psychic deck, I hope. But Psychic Dark, nice. So I guess it's not Malamar, or maybe yes. Let's see. Really good hand, but no basic. We had the Lily, the Nest Ball, the Energy. Really, really good hand. That is a really good hand too. We have a Lily. That is a really good hand too. Okay, so it's a Weavile deck. Maybe Weavile 
Lele. Maybe straight Weavile with Lele. We go first, so we don't bench it right now. Maybe, I mean, we are gonna bench it like 100%. 100%. But we go first, so we can wait what the opponent starts. For me, the Bass Rock is best deck in format right now. But it's my opinion for sure. Malamar is one of the best deck right now, too. So are we buy maybe? Yes. Okay, so let's go for the big lily. So if we find the Slugma or Nest Ball. So normally I don't use the Acrobike if I don't need it, but I really want to find the Slugma. Okay, so I guess we see Cynthia next turn. So I guess we will pass. I don't want to bench big pass EX if I don't need it. Sorry, Weavile. Yes, maybe. Let's see. <clears throat> Latios is really complicated. I had some problems. I, I lost one round in the League Cup against Zoro Rock that I didn't draw so well. And he had the Latios. And he takes two prizes in one turn, so he avoids the Sledgehammer. So I lost that game. That I, but I could win anyway the game. But it was it wasn't uh, easy, honestly. Okay, let's go. Let's see if we have the DNC. Perfect. So we, we can KO. And I will put some pressure with Rockcraft. So uh, I want to put the choice band because uh, I really want to draw the Slugma into the Cynthia. So we think one card and the Slugma put a lot of pressure. Okay, so I guess we go. We did come through one B-string with no problem. We need to keep the other B-string anyway. So next time we can evolve to Makar one, draw Lily or something. I guess we KO the Sorua. Nah, we have... Mm, I want to save the Lycan Rock for later, honestly. And if you have also Sorak, is fine anyway. Nah, let's KO... Not sure, but Sorak is draw power. Okay, I'm not sure, but I'm gonna kill the Sorua. I want to try that play. Not sure if it's good play. But let's try, let's try. Because if he evolves to Weavile... If he evolves to Weavile, he needs... Kukui and it's not KO anyway. He needs Kukui in the stadium. Yeah, maybe don't need the third baby bus. That's true, Cocotin. We should wait for Putan or Anguru, maybe. Yep, that baby bus was not uh, needed, definitely. Malo. I think we did well, Kyoto Sorua. Not sure. Because now, if we evolve to Makar, we will have three abilities. Mm, nah, that's not the perfect world. But it's fine. It's one less arc, so it should be fine. So he malo for next turn and he will hit here and in the Lycan Rock, I guess. But yeah, third baby bus was not needed. So I guess we can Makaru for Lily. Or Makaru for Cynthia and keep the Lily for later. Oh. Why you malo and then Ultra Ball? Come on. <laughs> Why you Malo and then Ultra Ball? What is that order, my friend? What is that order, my friend? I don't understand. Yeah, that's true, Godin. Por qué haces Malo y luego Ultra Ball? Por qué? Pro play. Pro players. Omega Lul. I mean, I do that misplay sometimes, so I can't complain. I can't lag because I do that misplay sometimes too. Yeah, he saw the deck and he was like, nah, let's Ultra Ball. Oh, that Kukui is really, really nice. Because we can tweet Kyo the Latios, so I guess we take a supporter for next one anyway. 
I really want to take a supporter for next turn to set up better. Right? That is fine. Because Beast Energy was not a KO. The Beast Energy was not a KO anyways. was 100. Timer Ball. So that's the Weavile. But Latios is annoying, honestly. Latios is annoying. Latios is a little annoying. For example, if he kills the baby bass and then the Lycan Rock, he avoids the Sledgehammer. That's why uh, the Lycan Rock play was so so. Maybe fine, but uh, it was one less so arc, so it should be fine. So now he needs. Okay this so let's go Cynthia and then Macaru for something Kukui then is mode over sounds better yeah yes in mm, yes in that turn that's true in that situation that's true because if we hit the Cynthia with the Kukui we smooth over for a better car so uh, you you are correct Cocotin in that situation was better because we are gonna Cynthia next turn so if we Kukui and find the Cynthia or Lily we smooth over for a better car. That's true. We are always learning some things. We are always learning. Okay. If he had the Guzma, he's fine. I will put the DC anyway. That's true, honestly. Uh, okay, so let's smack cargo for... I'm really not sure who is, who is going to do my opponent. So when I'm not sure, normally I take Acrobike. When I'm not sure. So it depends on what the opponent do. Uh, do. I will uh, acrobat for the card that I need with my cargo. But yeah, that was a little better play. That Kukui and then small over because that situation, that scenario was like, I'm gonna take the Cynthia anyway, so maybe we hit them with the Kukui and we can move over for a DC or Goose or energy or something that match should be not an auto win but should be really favorable that matchup seems really really favorable because once you set up a cargo it's like you have a control every turn he has nothing So let's kill the Sora, right? Let's kill the Sora. So I will put this and I will make cargo for. I have the Acro Bike. We have the Beast Ring, we have the Guzma. Let's. I don't know. Kui. We have a lot of things. So let's kill the Sora Arc. So next turn we can, if he kills the Zoro Arc, the Lycan Rock, the next turn we can Mac Cargo for the Beast Energy and Guzma de Lele. Oh, we don't need the Beast Energy, right? It's 150, 170. So next turn if he kills the Lycan Rock with Guzma de Lele. Thoughts on Acrobike for Beast Energy so you can kill it with Baby Bass? Yeah, maybe it was better, but if we kill with Lycan Rock, he activate a Sledgehammer to kill Lele. So at that point, yeah, that time did nothing but when I faced the Latios in the League Cup he played Kukui the same turn so he hit for 130 into the bench and then he Guzma and take two prizes so without Kukui is fine but with Kukui is hard so Serpentage in that scenario I guess it was the same because if he killed Lycan or he activates Sledgehammer but maybe in another scenario it's better your play like imagine the opponent is at five prizes so if he killed the Lycan Rock is bad for us so in that scenario, that the opponent is not at 6 prices, maybe it's better to go for the Beast Energy and Kyosaur with the Baby Bass, for sure. Yeah, Jeremy, that's true. So we go second and start Brockraft. That is not good. That is not good, but 
That pass is scary. That pass is scary because I'm really sure he has the Vika Bolt. I'm really, really sure he has the Vika Bolt. Really, really sure. He has the Vika Bolt for sure. So I want to... Yeah, I mean, I really want to attack with Baby Bass, so I want to keep the, uh, the switch. The Lily, I guess I will throw the Acrobatic. Mm. Should I keep the Acrobatic? I will keep the Acrobatic. I will keep the Acrobatic. I'm really sure he has the Vika Bolt, really, really sure. I will keep the Acrobatic. Let's see. Oh, perfect. So we need another baby bus. And I will wait the acrobatic. So if he has the KO, it's fine. If he has the KO, he's fine. And the Vika will RNG pull. Let's go for Marchado. I don't have Marchado, Jeremy. <laughs> if I have it, if I have it, I will go for Marchado play. So oh, he has the Vika Ball or he has nothing with that pass, right? Like, he has the Vika Ball or he has nothing. Let's see. Let's see. That's the thing that, I mean, that's one of the scenarios that I want to keep the Acrobat over than keep the energy. That's the Vika Ball. That's one of the scenarios that I want to keep the Acrobat. Because in a scenario like that, that you Lillian, you have no energy, like this a scenario. Uh, sorry, Lillian, no supporter for next turn. I have the acrobat to have another out for next turn. That's why I threw an energy, like two energies over the acrobat, because in the lily, if we find no energy like this time, uh, it's another out to have a supporter. Why, Cocotin? Because we lose the beast energy. So what should do? What should we do? Yeah. What should what was the play to? Why he why he didn't KO? Oh, I don't understand nothing. Why you didn't KO my baby bass? I didn't mention second Rokura because we don't need it. Uh, we don't need it. The second Rokraft. One Rokraft is fine. What was the play, Kogoti? I was not sure to. I was not sure. Play Cynthia. With Diancy we get the Beakable, but we have no Diancy. We don't need Field Blower normally in this matchup. Oh, okay, he couldn't KO. Okay. 120 is not KO, you are right. Should I go for the Beakable? No, right? He's gonna Goosem anyway. But we can go for the Beakable and then Jet Punch. I really like to put the energy to Rokura because a lot of people go for the Rokura and it's a bad play. That's true, 120 is not Kyo, sorry, people, sorry. 120 is not Kyo, that's true. I guess I will go Cynthia. So, let's put the Sluggy Boy. So, if we hit for 60. And then 50 is not Kyo, but we will have the Kukui, right? So I don't want to put the Diancy because if the opponent is smart, if the opponent is good, he will KO the Diancy. So I will wait this turn. I will bench this. And now I will mark cargo for. I mean, next turn we have Kukui 70 plus 60 is KO. Perfect. So. Uh, I will mac cargo for what is the best thing? I guess the best thing is Guzma in case the best thing I guess is Guzma in case he's I guess the best, best option is Guzma in case he retreat the he switch the Rayquaza. So I guess that mac cargo play is fine. 
I feel at Ultra World the bike get Baby Bass attached this hero craft switch and Lily Pass was better. And next one you have the option to use depending on how. <clears throat> yeah, I see that point. I see that point, like, Rocker up with DC is uh, really scary for the opponent too. Discard the Acrobat and keep the Beast energy for neck for less Sledgehammer turn. And you can close mass the Big Ball turn 2 maybe. Yeah, imagine he kept the Baby Bass and then close slash the Big Ball and we win. Because he has only one Big Ball in field. Yeah, that's true. I guess that was a better approach. I guess that was a better approach, honestly. Yeah, definitely try to close slash the pick I don't know, I mean, both plays are fine, I guess. Both plays are fine, right? That is really interesting because we can talk about possible plays. Uh, and I guess both plays were fine. Keep the Acrobat or keep the Beast and put the DC into the Rockcraft. So I guess board plays are fine. It's really hard to find a perfect play, but it's really interesting to see other options. So I think the cocoting option is really interesting too. Yeah, imagine he killed the baby bus. Imagine he has the same hand on turn one, but one more right. He killed the baby bus and I'm in a little problem. Not sure. Okay, so now we kill this and we need to prepare the sledgehammer turn for this boy. So now we need the DNC, now we need this. So next turn we need KO this. So I guess we go for the Kukui. So next turn we can uh, Kukui and find the choice band to kill this. So I will go for another Kukui. So next time we can try to find the Lycan Rock and kill this. So I will Kukui. Okay. <laughs> okay, so depends on the next turn we can do something or not. Perfect. So next time we can go for the Beast Ring turn too. We can go for the Lycan Rock play. We can go for a lot of plays. The energy attachment turn 1 into baby bus have no value. Yeah, in this matchup, you are gonna wait the sledgehammer anyway, that's true. In this matchup, uh, he's gonna take the two first prizes normally. I mean, I were, I was lucky to take that two prizes. But normally, right, take the two first prizes, so there is no hurry to put energy into baby bus in this matchup. So maybe attaching to that rock graph was better. Hmm. Yeah, depends on the opponent board for sure. Yep. Okay, so he's gonna KO with. If he goes to KO with Rai, we KO with Baby Bass Choice Fan. If he KO with Delmice, uh, okay, he go for the DNC. That is really smart. That is really smart, honestly. So I guess we will we will go for the B ring time with the Big Pass. Now we kill the Delmais with Kukui and then we need to find the we need to find the big bass play. So we save the Rockcraft. So uh, now it's 120, we need the Kukui, and then next turn if he kill the baby bass, we need the peace ring turn with big, big bass GX. So we have the Brooklet to find the big bass. So I don't want to put the Brooklet on Big Bass right now. I don't want to put the Brooklet and Big Pass uh, right now because it can goose the Big Pass. So I will Kukui. That's the Lycan Rock, but now we don't have the KO. I want to save the Lycan Rock. The thing is, he has no Counter Stadium, right? Normally he has no Counter Stadium. The problem is, now we have uh, two options. If we, do, if we put the Pass Rock 
sorry, the big pass, and with B3 in the big pass, he can KO with Guzma. But he had two Guzma in the, in the discard, he has two Guzma in the discard, so if we don't bench the big pass now, he can match shadow us. That's what happened in my league cap, sorry, in the league cap that I play on Saturday. That when I prepared this turn, my opponent marched out to B and I lost one game. I win anyway to one. I win anyway to one, but I lost that game because I wait this turn to don't bench the big pass, but he marched out to me and I lost. But having he's having two Guzmas in the discard and only four energies, so I will take the risk. I will take the risk and put it on board. I will take the risk and put it on board. Uh, so yeah, let's see. I will take the risk because it's more likely he marched to me than he Guzma, he third Guzma plus KO. Because in the, in four cards hand he needs Bicable Energy Guzma. He has two Guzmas in the discard, so that's why I want to take the risk. Maybe it's bad play. Maybe it's bad play, but I was thinking. That is more likely he has marchado than third Guzman. <laughs> okay. So I lost. <laughs> so it was better to was better to wait. It was better to wait. Sad life. He has the third Guzma, so what's better to wait? Uh, we shouldn't take the risk. We shouldn't take the risk. Right? Uh, I lost the game. I mean... Oh, it was so unlikely, right, that he have everything. It was so unlikely that he has everything. Okay, so what is the play? Okay, the Vika Vault. So maybe he has no Guzma at one point. I could, but. Uh, if I KO the Vega Vault, he can KO with Delmice and put another Grove in on board. That's my opinion, Lubirul. If I. I mean, Delmice KO Lycan Rock, so he, I can't be string, and then uh, he can put another Grove in. I don't know. Okay, so it's 100, 120. 100, 120. One hundred, one twenty, with the GX. I mean, it's not chaos. So I need to kill the Pika Bolt this turn. So let's smack cargo for energy. I don't have DCE. DCE is in the discard. Sad. That is sad. So. I mean, he wins by Guzma, so I will bench the, this two. So then, need, next, next time I need to retreat. He can't KO, I need, I need to retreat. Uh, that would be, be... Oh, he had the... <laughs> no way! <laughs> he had the three Guzmas and everything? Nah. So I should wait the V-string turn and I will... I mean, if we don't V-string that turn... If we don't beat that turn, we win the game by B3 next turn. Uh, yeah, for sure. I mean, Jeremy, we should wait. We should wait one turn and then do the same play. But there is an option that if I do that, he marched on me, right? 
So he has four cards in hand, two Guzmas in the discard. So it was like really unlikely he had the energy choice band or energy right pickable Guzma, right? So in my mind, Mark Shadow play was more easy to find it than the third Guzma. So I take the risk and it was a bad play. <laughs> because that happened in my league cup, you know? The have everything, so the opponent March Shadow Mickey and I have nothing. But yeah, I should wait maybe. I should wait on the opponent March Shadow Mickey, try to find the play again. I think so. It's fine. It's fine. I mean both plays were fine, I guess, so I take the risk and it was bad. Yep. Okay, so uh, 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 I guess I will go my first. Should I go for the Oranguru or the Slugma? I guess I will go for the Slugma and Supporter turn. Supporter next turn. Uh, two turns more. Right? So I don't want to help my opponent, so I will pass. If I can find Marshall, I can find Lele for Guzma. Yeah, but if he, if he Lele for Guzma, I can like him with GX KO the right Quasa. Right? You know what I mean, League, uh, League King? If he find the Lele for Goose, I can KO the right Quasa with the GX of Lycanor, but he finds the Guzma naturally. He finds the, not, the, goose, the third Guzma naturally, right? So. So yeah, that's what, for example when I when I say that oh that's a garb version mm, not easy right only two items garb version so uh, it's two hit key anyway so we put uh, another baby pass two hit key anyway so I will power up two baby pass so we'll go for uh, Lily I guess. And maybe he can't retreat, maybe. So now we need to don't use more than two items if possible. Let's try to hope don't uh, use more than two items. <clears throat> That's why I said, for example, that even I played this deck like more than one month or two months. I am doing a lot of misplays too anyway, so we are continue learning. I don't like that play Coco team because if he counter energy into Garbodor with Mac Cargo, I lose a baby bus with three energies. Coco team. That's the reason only. If he plays counter energy, he kills with counter energy the baby bus and I have nothing to come back. You know what I mean, Coco team? So I prefer to spray the energies in that matchup for the option that maybe he has the counter energy. So Garp can KO. Or Baby Bass can KO. Both can KO. I mean, maybe it's better to put in the active, but in my mind, I prefer to put energies into both. So he's gonna make cargo for the switch, I guess. Oranguru for switch, I guess. Okay, <clears throat> 50. So we need to put pressure for sure. We need to put pressure into Baby Bass. So let's go for this. So it's 50. So next turn, we can be energy KO. So I guess we go for the Kukui for next turn. So now we Lily. And it's really important to not uh, to take the first two prizes. So I really want to switch, but <clears throat> I don't want to use more items if possible. So I 
I mean, if he finds the Kukui, he needs the Beast Energy, but if, if he puts the Beast Energy, we KO. So, I will put the Beast here. Maybe we can wait too. We can wait too. Let's put the beast here. So 50 and then 80. So next so we can bench Rockcraft and put the basic. I don't like to put Oranguru in that matchup of Coco team because if the opponent normally the opponent goes for if the opponent is smart, the opponent goes beast energy. Guzma Oranguru and he takes the two first prizes. That's why I don't like to put the Oranguru in this matchup, if possible, uh, Cocotin. Maybe I'm bad, but normally I play like that. And I always try to avoid Oranguru in this matchup for the Beast Energy, Guzma, KO, Oranguru. But maybe you are correct and I should put the Oranguru. But normally I try to avoid that the opponent take the two first prizes. But. I don't know, not sure. That's the Beast Energy. Okay, the Stadium. Okay, so now if, I guess we need to switch. Now I guess we need to switch because we need to take the two first prizes, so... I guess I will go for Brooklet to put the Rockcraft. So he need the Kukui to get the big the baby bus, but it's fine. Normally they don't play Blower. Normally they don't play Blower, so I will put this here. Because Macargo is normally really unlikely that they normally it's really unlikely that they KO the Macargo in this matchup, so I put the choice band into Macargo. And I will put the start the Rockcraft. So now he needs a Kukui. And then I will try to uh, then I will try to kill the the Ansi with Lycanroc, so Lycanroc can take two prizes. Now we need the Kukui. Let's see if he has the Kukui. He have one in the discard. And he needs to thin the hand to draw it with Oranguru too. So yeah, he can thin the hand. So next one I guess <clears throat> next one I guess we go <clears throat> sorry if we can go Guzma the Oranguru is maybe better play if we go if we go Guzma Oranguru is better play than evolve like rock but we have no Guzma and if I evolve like and rock and we kill the Oranguru he is Sledgehammer but maybe he has no Guzma. So if he Guzma, he can't just let Hammer anyway. LOL, Mars. <laughs> he was thinking like, okay, I discard. LOL, really? LOL, why not play Kukui? Why not play Kukui, LOL? <laughs> that was super funny, honestly. That was super funny. That was super funny. So now we hit 60, 80, 110. So I guess we KO anyway. That was super funny, right? So let's KO this <coughs> Garp. Let's do Cynthia. That play was super funny. It was super funny. Okay, so next turn. I will go for the DCE and attack it with Lycan Rock. I 
And if he killed the Rockcraft, we kill with Baby Pass. That Mars, that Venus. Because if he discard one item, it's KO. <laughs> LOL. LOL. <clears throat> so normally who takes the two free prizes win so i guess we are in a really good position right now we are in a really good position so we kill the baby bus now so let's kukui or the Lycan Rock. Let's kill the Baby Bass for sure. It's the early power up it. And Cloud Slash. So that's the game plan. Only through uh, two items. Three maximum if possible. One, two, three. And you should be fine against Shrine. And you should be super fine. So Garbodo hits for 60 only. Garbodo hits for 60 only. We can Goose Mandor and Guru now, for example, too. That's a lot of plays to win the game right now. We can kill the Ranguru, we can kill the Garp. We can keep the hand because we don't need nothing important right now. So I guess we go Brooklet. Brooklet KO Garp, that should be fine. If we play Acerola, well, that would be crazy too. It goes for another Travish, maybe. I guess it's gonna be the last game for today. Yeah, Lattice sounds good, I guess, uh, Thanks a lot to everyone. We were a lot of people today. Uh, thanks to the new subs and, sub and, fo and subscribers. Follow subs, uh, sorry. Followers and subscribers. Thanks a lot. Uh, I don't know why there is not appear in the chat today, so thanks a lot to everyone. I will try to fish it for tomorrow. Okay, so let me think. Uh, yeah, tomorrow at the same hour, okay? Tomorrow I will be at the same hour. Let's get the garb. So I need that. Brooklet. I need a Brooklet, right? Oh. For next turn. So yeah, tomorrow at the same hour. Tomorrow at the same hour. Thanks a lot to everyone. <clears throat> I hope you enjoyed the stream. It was super cool. I will save the B stream, right? <clears throat> hey Tobias, uh, okay, so below the channel, okay, a little below the channel, you can, the, the screen, you can check the, the schedule for every week, and if you follow me on Twitter, that you can watch in the screen, I put the, normally I put the schedule in this Twitter too, but you can find it below the screen, uh, there is a... Uh, a schedule with Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, in depends on the hour that you leave. Okay, so you can check it, Tobias, there. To everyone, okay? No, it's fine, Tobias, thanks a lot for asking. Thanks a lot for asking, it's fine. I hope you enjoyed the stream, everyone. And yeah, I hope to try to fish it, that should appear the followers and subs in the screen, but it'll be an update or something. So yeah, tomorrow maybe we play the Chaimiko deck, with Malamar maybe, so yes, that should be funny. Uh, yes, I hope you, you, enjoy, you enjoy the stream. Pues eso, gracias a todos. Thanks, Jeremy. Gracias a todos, y mañana a la misma hora, so same hour tomorrow. I will show the list again. This is the same list I played on Frankfurt with one change. I entered the third Kukui. Uh, it's the list that I won a League Cup uh, on Saturday. And yeah, thanks to the subs too. So let's finish this game. So let's kill the Weavile, right? And be the other boy. Be the other boy, so. 
uh, let's go for B string. Oh, one B string is into the into the prices. That's true. Um, so let's go for an energy, I guess. Oh, we have the energy. We have the Guzman. We have everything. So let's go for an energy for next turn, maybe. Yeah, I have everything, so we can be string. We have the Guzma. So I will show the list again to the all people. But yeah, 10 basics, 1 beast energy. 10 basic, 1 beast energy. Uh, really cool. Nice deck. I really enjoy it. So yeah. I will finish for today, tomorrow the same hour, thanks a lot to everyone, and I will host some friend, and see you tomorrow, people. Have a good day, have a good night, and bye.